Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'll show you how to make these fingerless gloves. I made these gloves from Liverpool stretchy fabric. And the glove looks like that. And the pattern is 22 centimeters wide by 36 centimeters long. And the fabric stretches this way. Now I'll prepare my glove pattern. I'm folding this pattern in half like that, the long way, and the right side is inside. I'm folding this pattern in half and I'm pinning the center. So that's the center on a glove. Next, I'll pin the thumbnail measurement. So I'll pin 4.5 centimeters from the top center on both sides, on one side and other side. Next, my thumb measurement will be five centimeters. So I'm pinning on both sides five centimeters. So it looks like that. And next I'm folding the edges on the hem approximately six millimeters to the wrong side on one side and other side like that. So my pattern is ready to sew. These are my measurements for my glove and I will sew straight stitch there. All along there and there I'll leave that and that bit open so I'm using one centimeter seam allowance doing back and forward stitch and I'm stretching my fabric slightly when I'm sewing doing back and forward stitch again missing that five centimeter seam there and sewing all along there again I'm doing back and forward stitch then missing five centimeter up there and sewing to the other hem there and again doing back and forward stitch to secure the seam cutting all excess cotton off and this is how it looks nice and stretchy next I'm ironing my um, glove pattern flat like that so as you can see I have ironed that seam flat and both edges for the hem flat like that so it looks like that. That is the hem on both sides. Next, I'm folding my glove pattern in half like that. And I'll be sewing a straight stitch all along there. And I'll be sewing two millimeters of the original seam there. So I'll start sewing there. As you can see, all of the, that seam allowance is ironed flat and I'm sewing a straight stitch two millimeters of the original seam all along to the other end. So it looks like that, nice and stretchy. Next, I'm turning my glove pattern to the other side, to other seam allowance side as you can see there and I'll sew another straight stitch there two millimeters of the original seam again so basically I'm repeating same process as I did on other side so it looks like that next I'm turning my glove pattern to the right side from that side so I'm turning that to the right side that's the thumb hole there and next I will sew up this hem opening together all around with black cotton and a needle with invisible stitch When I sew invisible stitch on my glove, I pull my fabric slightly so the glove hem stretches when I put the gloves on. And my glove hem is finished nice and stretchy. It looks like that. Now I'll try my finished glove on fits very nicely. I'll try my other glove on and my gloves are finished. If you have any questions how I made my gloves please do comment down below in a comment box. Also if you wish to make your own gloves please measure your hands and add your own measurements when you make your gloves.
Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. I'll see you next time. Love, Anita.